um, I wanted to combine the fact with uh, my thought of the day because Yuri's legacy is kinship personified. Um, she was a living example of our saying, there is no us and them, only us. Um, I feel like we live in a time where there's an illusion of separateness that's constantly being fed to us every day, whether it's from the media, advertisements, like big corporations, whatever. It's very easy to feel like no one understands our struggles and no one ever will. Um, but that's not the case here. Um, one of the reasons why I love Homeboy so much is that when you walk through these doors, that all seems to fade away and you realize that the division that we feel in life is really just an illusion. So um, in gardening, there's a practice called permaculture. It's an ancient method where certain plants are intentionally grown next to one another because they each provide something that the others lack and they can't create on their own. And I tend to think that we're the same way as human beings. Um, we grow better together than we do in isolation. We grow stronger when we know that we're not alone. So um, this method is truly embodies the teaching of oneness and what benefits one of us naturally benefits us all. So similarly, what hurts one of us hurts all of us. So if we act like skilled gardeners, we can look beneath the surface and see the oneness of all things. And in turn, we can care for others just like we care for ourselves. So all that being said, um, here at Homeboy, one person's fight is all of our fights. When one person wins, we all win. And it's here that we're reminded that we need each other's strength to become the best version of ourselves.